Sarah Jacobson, Marketing Artfully. So one of the immutable laws of life is that as soon as I start a video, the neighbor's yard man will come. So this is my second try at this one. Um, what we're going to do today is we're going to look at Pinterest because it's my favorite site for marketing um, my Etsy products, whether it's my vintage or my digital. Um, I know some people do great with Facebook. That's not my expertise. So we're going to talk about Pinterest. So what I want you to do is I want you to think about your products and how they show up on Pinterest. And I'm going to do three types of things. A physical product, handmade, possibly a vintage product, and then a digital product. So that's what we're going to go through. And we want to take a peek and see how these products look on Pinterest because this is going to make a difference in how you are going to present them, how you're going to market them. We saw even on the Etsy site that sometimes having um, words on the on the pins would be right. Sometimes they wouldn't. Um, one couple couple quick tips here. Uh, if you use a um, a different browser that you're not logged into, so for me that's Firefox. I don't, um, I don't want to, uh, I don't want to be logged in. I just want to get a picture so I can go to any other site, do a search, right? And then uh, you'll be able to see a little bit different, right? So it depends. This is the same. This guy is. This guy isn't here, so it'll give you an idea what it looks like when you're logged in and when you're not logged in, meaning that when you're logged in, it's all based on past things you personally have done on Pinterest. Um, they're going to, uh, you may see more pins with uh, words on them if you click on those more. So. They have algorithms that kind of track that, but I never really worry about it. I just want an overall picture of what is going to work best. So let's do baby blankets. So it's come to my um, my one because I do watch some videos that every top left is a video. So if you wanted to do a video, and maybe we'll do some videos tomorrow, you'll be able to see it up here. Then... This is a free crochet pattern, top and bottom. Free crochet pattern, easy crate and barrel. So there's a, that's not a baby blanket, that's a baby dress. Um, seedling crochet blanket pattern. Okay, so these are all, oh, here we go, mountain baby blanket Etsy. And that's just a picture. So we're going to start thinking about what we're seeing. It's just a picture, but it's a lifestyle picture. Uh, da, 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 da. Crochet baby blankets pattern. Baby blanket, how to crochet it. So for me, I, if I was a knitter, I would also do patterns of the things you do. But that's I, I say that very cavalierly, like, oh, it's so easy to sell patterns. But it's something I would think about. Okay, uh, bye bye baby. So that's like a my daughter's pregnant, so I like baby blankets right now, right? Um, so it looks like just a baby blanket is a lot of patterns. Next, so this is a fun one best baby blankets, right? So now we have a different search, so we still have that crochet pattern, free patterns, so we still have patterns. Um, baby quilt. This is a, this is a rich pin, which you get from Etsy. You don't have to worry about that. But this is a different site. Little unicorn cotton muslin baby quilt. Nice baby quilt. I like quilts. Okay, so we see that best baby blankets is going to be a way to, um, to rank in Pinterest search, right? Okay, still looking. Baby blanket, crochet patterns, cozy patterns, knitting patterns. Okay, I feel like we're still, oh, there's another one. 
that's an Etsy Etsy one. Okay. Uh, double lace bindery. Vict okay. And this is sort of a lifestyle, right? It's not like cut out and on the thing. So let's look at this. Why did this show up for best baby blankets? And I would think she has to have best in here somewhere. I would have best in there somewhere. I don't see it. Okay, there's a minky. Oh, what's a minky? Double layer pink white minky. So now that I've gotten into an Etsy on Pinterest, I'm going to see more Etsy things, right? So there's Target, there's Etsy, there's snacks, there's Etsy. It's not a baby blanket either. There's a pattern, crochet pattern. Okay. So then the next thing I would search is Etsy, Etsy baby blankets, right? This is going to give us an apples to apples thing. Now look at this. This is a, if I was you, I would make videos of your baby blankets. You just upload those. You say create, create pin, upload. We'll make one of those tomorrow. I'm going to show you how to make pins for all this. Um, but that is amazing. You just take out your phone. Let's see how long this sucker is. This is 12 seconds. So you take out your phone, you record your thing for 12 seconds, and you upload it. They love videos right now. Okay, so these are all lifestyle. So they're all kind of on something, right? Cutest craft. Okay, on a hanger, baby swaddle. Okay, I love this one. So you have the, the back and the close-up. So that could be one. I think this one would benefit. Plus you need light bright pictures, people. Light bright pictures. Okay, oh, this must, I bet you that's the, the hoot. The hoot, yep. They have that same template. We'll, we'll make a template tomorrow too. Okay. So it looks like on, Etsy, on Pinterest, Etsy does the best with just a plain picture, right? Does that mean that I would never post one with words? Heck to the no, I would be posting with words. Okay, now I'm going to do a vintage one, right? So this is hobnail glass. And for those of you who do not know what hobnail glass is, it's bumpy glass. So this is a DIY how to make hobnail glass. This is Kimberly. I don't know what that means. This is a DIY bud vases. Etsy. Etsy is the first one. Now what you need to know, this is a um, promotion. So there is no video right here of this. This is not a video on Etsy. I don't want you to get confused. We can now upload videos to our Etsy, some of us. Um, but this would be a video, and I'll show you how you can create a pin. Let's not mess this up. Pinterest. Pinterest. So I do little videos all the time for my, um, uh, 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 so you're just going to drag your video in here. I do videos all the time for my little shop. So here is a tiny video that I just did with my, um, this is a one minute long one that I kind of spit up, but it is just a little quick video. It's nothing exciting. Sometimes I have my daughter hold the camera. Um, you can have sound, you can not have sound. Do not stress about it, but I would do a little video there. Okay, we have a lot of, um, I feel like there's a lot of buying pins here. Milk Blast 101, that's a blog. Okay. Very pretty picture though. Benton Hobnail Milk Glass. Social Graces Vintage. This is a product page. That is a nice picture that would be shared, right? Okay, so for our vintage people, I feel like, and this is why you have to look for your product, guys. I feel like the Vintage people are doing well with the the lifestyle pictures just on the plain old hobnail glass search. 
Okay, next we're going to do vintage hobnail glass. So now we're getting rid of the um, how to hobnail glass and we're doing vintage hobnail glass. All right, so now we have that's more of the, you know, take the back away. So three of those are there. I would definitely try a picture of that with that. Now, I think a little bit of that might have to do because you're taking a picture of something white on white, there's more contrast. If you had like a pretty blue hobnail glass, maybe not. Okay, let's see what these are. Etsy, eBay, Tius, I don't know what that is. Etsy. Okay, so if you get into vintage hobnail, there's eBay. I don't know what that is. It's just a picture. God bless them. Okay. Um, so it looks like you could do, oh my gosh, look how cute that is. Okay, I want us to remember this. Let's click on here. So this is an amazing picture. Hobnail glass vintage. So sh let's, let's see this. Can we see it? See full item details. And this is Jenny Sandberg Vintage amazing picture okay so let's see what she has so she has lifestyle this is sold and then this looks like maybe a stock photo that she has um so we're gonna save this this is really good that is a good example jenny sandberg vintage and she's had over 3500 sales girlfriend is doing an amazing job we love her okay so just doing vintage hobnail glass gets you into the Etsy thing, but having more of a lifestyle look seems to be way high up or having a black um, thing. Now let's see what the last search is. Hobnail vintage glass Etsy, and we're, um, we're going to look at these. There's hers again. Now see, I would have that going to her hobnail glass category. But that's just me that's cute with all the colors turquoise see she has three colors but is this just the turquoise it catches your eye on etsy that's her again oh i love her she's doing very well okay see she's just selling the the um the turquoise one but she's showing us a picture that is aspirational so that's an aspirational picture that's very good we all have a bunch of crap around we can put together right there's some more together okay so that will give you an idea how to search for your that's a very expensive hobnail sugar bowl i bet see how much it is it's just a picture why why would you have just a picture on pinterest okay now I'm going to do printable ephemera, and this is just plain old printable ephemera. So we, ha uh, this is Etsy, <gasps> top left. Is it a video? Nope. Now, do you know why that is an Etsy one? It's because Pinterest knows now that Tara clicks on Etsy things, right? Um, which I did it anyways. But if we had a, a printable ephemera that was to Etsy that was a video, that might have gone in there. Okay. Because they do want us to shop. See how they've changed this? This is explore. This is shop. On every search result, they want you to be able to shop. And my guess is, and this is just a guess, that they get at least some affiliate commission or they get some kind of kickback from Etsy. Because I'm an affiliate for Etsy. If I recommend an Etsy product, I get a small commission for it. Um, I bet you they get a little bit of revenue from that, even if it's not a paid ad on Pinterest for a promoted listing. So their whole site is now set up to shop, right? Now shop just doesn't mean Etsy, right? Let's see what the shop says again. Let's think there's a video right there. Okay, shop. Etsy, 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 Compass and Ink. Nope, still Etsy. Lowe's. Zazzle. 
lot of Etsy. So, oh, let's do this again. Let's do a uh, best baby blanket. Oh, this is exciting. So if we go to shop, shop, we have Wayfair, Little Giraffe, West Elm, Etsy, Zazzle. So more of a mix. There must be more baby blankets for sale in different places. But look at all. And they're really pushing the shop. Let's do our vintage hobnail. Sh Not going to be able to say it. Vintage hobnail glass. And let's click on the shop. Shop. And this is going to be Etsy. Oh, Cherish. That's another place. Food 52. Etsy. Food 52. Just Food 52. Etsy. Cherish. I'm surprised there's not more eBay because we did see some eBay in there. And you don't have to do anything to get yourself in this. You just have to put a link to your product, right? Etsy. Uh, Etsy and Pinterest technically do that together. Putting my fingers together like you guys can see it. All right. So this is, first off, this is printed out printable ephemera, right? This is printed out. Those are ticket strips. That's not printable, but that's still a, okay, free vintage printable. A lot of Etsy in here for the vintage printable. Train tickets, ticket tickets. Transport tickets, boards and eggs. Okay, so railway tickets. So there's a Etsy. I recognize that lady sells a lot of these on Etsy. Etsy. Um, okay, so now let's do printable ephemera tickets Etsy. Okay, so now there's a video. Yay, video. Please do videos. 600 by 900 is fine. 600 pixels wide by 900 pixels tall. <gasps> Joanne's wants me to buy something. There's a shop. Okay. These all Etsy, Etsy, Etsy. Oh, that's cute. I like those. Oh, why does it say Etsy? Not say Etsy. So she's, is she selling this? 50% off sale. And those are earrings. Okay, not even close. Is this was that promoted? I feel like that didn't match the other. See, every once in a while you'll see something weird, but maybe because I bet you she stole that thing. Okay, and last but not least, let's look at this. Oh, that's it. So that is how you take a peek. Now, tomorrow we're going to do the same thing, but I'm going to show you physically how to make a video, how to make um stuff on your pinterest it won't be a super long one i have a whole class about this but i don't want to leave you guys hanging and go hey make some pinterest pictures hope you have help <laughs> hope it works um so i'll at least give you a mini tutorial on that tomorrow so tara jacobson marketing artfully